everybody and welcome back to my channel. It's me, Katie Veliz, back with another Dollar Tree haul. And today, you guys, we have a special guest. We have my youngest daughter, Madison Vera. Say hi, Maddie Lulu. Hi. She decided she's going to join me because we have some good finds that we found in the toy section these last couple of weeks. So she is going to help reveal those toys with me. And before we get started, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, you guys. Don't go anywhere and stick around. Oh, and give it a thumbs up. Give this video a thumbs up right now, okay? But without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Starting off this haul, we are going to be focusing on things that we found in the toy section. A lot of these products are good for Christmas, birthday gifts, or even just stocking stuffers. So one of the first things that I picked up, oops, sorry, <laughs> was this Transformers Jumbo Chalk Set. I just thought this really looked like high end you know something that you'd find at target or walmart um and it's only for a dollar you guys so i will definitely be gifting this to somebody during christmas next you guys i found these adventure shoes i got two pairs because i thought you know one of them would fit this girl right here but apparently her foot grew um and then another one will go to my niece but um you guys, these are toys that you can find at Walmart, Target. As I've said before, they really range like anywhere between seven to ten dollars. So I thought this was a good find. Next, you guys, we found some what is this? Soft and slow squishies. The girls really like these. And you guys, look how huge this is. It's like a big package for one dollar. It is a good brand. So I decided to get it, and Madison will be opening this for you guys right now. What's in there? Pink donut. Okay, looks like a pink donut. And another pink donut. And another pink donut. And a queen. A what? And a queen. What's that? They call your donut. Oh, whipped cream. And whipped then, cream that you put on your donut. Oh, donut. how cute. So it looks like you like stack it up like this, I think. And it comes with some like slime type of thing that you can play with. Next, you guys, we found some more squishies by the brand Soft and Slow Squishies. So I got three of them here. One of them I'm going to let Madison open and the other two I am going to save for gifts for this coming up holiday. Madison, what color do you want to open? Blue. Blue. Blue is her favorite color. Right here, you open these up and the squishies are in there. So, girl, poke your little finger in there. Oh. It's a cake. Oh, it's a cute little cake there. Cute little cupcake there. Oh, a koala. Girl, this is so cute. Look at that. So it came with um, three little squishies in there. So we are going to be getting into hair accessories, you guys. The hair accessory aisle did not disappoint me this time around. So I was able to find these barrettes here they are bows so this one here is a maroon one and oh and then a green one go ahead maddie pick it up and then oh she picked it up with the toes girl and then um this gray one the silver and then this one that fell a purplish one these are just so pretty you guys i just really like the glitter detail on here and then how it has like little speckles of stars on there so definitely a good find and then i found some scrunchies you guys the colors just reminded me of fall and i just like the detail on here it's like a little what would you call it like a little scrunch type of thing um but really pretty and i like how big these are so picked up all of these Next, you guys, we found some snap clips. These are just really pretty. I like how glossy and thick the clip is. So, girl, if you find these, pick them up, okay? Let's see, girl. Yes, girl. And then we found some more scrunchies. Um, I don't know how to pronounce the brand, but it is by the brand Scunchy Girl or Scunchy Scunky. I don't know what it is, but you guys, these are just a really pretty velvet scrunchie and then this one here comes with like a bow and it's wired so girl you can like fix it twist it whatever you want to do but really cute and i hope they come out with more colors and then i found some lily and jane scrunchies really pretty colors 
Um, they kind of remind me of like a summery vibe, but you know what? It was a good find, you guys. Um, but it says hair and wrist elastics. So you can style them in your hair or just wear them on your wrist. The last two hair accessories I found were these cute little headbands. How cute are these? Look at it. They just have little poof balls at the top. So cute. So we're going to have Madison model one of these, you guys, because they just, I just can't. I just can't. Go ahead, girl. Put it on. I want to wear this for the rest of the day. You want to wear it for the rest of the day? Yeah. So cute. Okay, ready? Pose. Cute. I like it. We're just going to have to remove that little thing right there. So I am now going to be getting into beauty products, you guys. The makeup section and skincare section did not disappoint, you guys. Um, Maddie decided to leave because she wanted to play with her squishies, which is totally fine. So I will go ahead and finish this up with you guys. One of the things I was so happy to find during my Dollar Tree hunt was this Ioni Everlasting Lash Glue. You guys. Let's just talk about the packaging first off. It just looks so pretty and it just really looks like it's gonna work good. It kind of reminds me of the, um, what is it called? The Kiss Glue, but that's what it reminded me of. The way it's like bluish tint with a clear type of look. And just look at that brush, you guys. So this says it is 100% vegan, whatever that means, okay? But you guys, I picked up two of these and I definitely like the way it works. It's holding my eyelashes right now. Okay. Um, but I really like it, you guys. So if you guys see this, definitely pick it up. I am definitely going to be picking up more up because you know what? You can't be eyelash glue for $1, okay? Next, speaking of Ioni, I found me some more eyelashes. So I picked up two of the Natural Light doll and then I picked two up of the Natural Light Wispy. So I really like going for a natural look and was really happy that I found these. So hopefully you guys can find them. Sometimes Dollar Tree won't even have it because you know there's just people who like to grab them all as soon as they are stocked up. So be on the lookout. Okay, you guys, this next one is such a good find and I'm so happy I finally found it. It is this battery operating electronic nail kit. Mariah likes doing my nails. So we were so stoked when we found this. You guys, it's just, it's just neat for $1. Like, come on now. Let me just say, Dollar Tree, you've done it. You've done it again. What? Real technique at the Dollar Tree, you guys. These products range anywhere from $8 to $9. So I was like blown away that I found these, okay? So the first thing that I grabbed was this Expert Air Cushion Sponge. It says to use dry and it says that this expert air cushion sponge is designed for buildable airbrushed coverage. Gently tap on cushion makeup until blended. Girl, we're going to definitely try that out. And then the next thing that I grabbed was this four miracle blotting cushions. They kind of reminded me of like a beauty blender, just like cut in half, you know, but it says that this multi-function, functional <laughs> girl, let's delete that. So it says these multi-functional miracle blotting cushions create a smooth and mattified finish. Use dry to dab on foundation, smooth creases, or blot oil areas. You guys, let's just, let's just give Dollar Tree a round of applause. Okay, I'm just shook. Okay, you guys, moving on. More good finds. Look, I just found some Flower Beauty at... The Dollar Tree. You guys, this makeup brand is by Drew Barrymore. You guys, let's just say I'm shook, okay? Because you're the next Drew Barry. 
and I want more. <laughs> I'm just joking, you guys. <laughs> but yeah, guys, I was like super stoked that I got my hands on these. I'm going to go ahead and swatch all these lippies for you guys to see how they feel. So the first one I am going to be testing out is Red Dye to Bloom. It is the number VC4. So, oh, wow, these are really juicy, you guys. Not dry at all. The next one I am going to try is the Mauve Over. Like, a move over, girl. This one is a VC2. And this is, oh, girl, that is really pretty. See that? And then the next one I am gonna be going in with is Life's a Peach, and this is the number VC1. Oh, this one's really light, but it's a really pretty color. I didn't expect it to be that nice, but you guys just look at the packaging. So cute. So the next one I am gonna test is the Coral Floral, and the number is VC5. And this one is like definitely a red color. So I love these, you guys. I'm gonna go ahead and try one on. So, girl, I really like the way this feels on your lips. It goes on really smoothly. And the one I put on was a mauve over, okay? Y'all just mauve over. So next is a repeat item that I have purchased before at the Dollar Tree, which is these Wet n Wild Under the Sheets, the 10-pack makeup removers. You guys, I like these, and I'm going to keep buying them, okay, until they are, like, removed from Dollar Tree. So I really like these. So let's just go ahead and remove this makeup or lipstick off my Look at That's just one wipe, you guys one wipe okay let's go ahead and go for two girl three four <laughs> okay but anyways it took it off you guys they work just for one dollar girl i really like these wipes so definitely be on the lookout for those and i recommend them okay <sighs> can i just say can I just say, Dollar Tree, y'all need to quit playing with me already, okay? Because first you give me real technique, then you give me some flower beauty, and now you giving me soft lips. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, I was so stoked to find these. You can find these at Target or Walmart, and they range anywhere from $3 to $4. So definitely be on the lookout for these soft lips. Hopefully they come out with more. Another Flower Beauty product that I found was this blush. I got it in the color, what is this color? It says Winsome Rouge Some, girl. Be on the lookout, Flower Power, I mean Flower Power, Flower Beauty at the Dollar Tree. Next products are just, you know, for the face, so I got me this Jade Facial Roller. I've never used one of these before, but I'm like, you know, what the hey? Let's try it out. So it says this relaxes facial muscles and nerves, reduces wrinkles. Not like I have any. You know, I don't age, you guys. It's like, I'm just joking. Um, speed up blood circulation and tighten skin's elasticity. So let me know how you guys use this. Give me some recommendations on how you guys use this, whether it's throwing it in the fridge, freezer, you guys let me know, okay? I'm excited to give this a try. And then I got me some mini tweezers. It came in a three pack and I just thought this was really a good find. Just throw these little tweezers in your makeup drawer or in your purse, you know just so when you need to pick out those pelitos okay so next you guys i found a lot of nail polishes at the dollar tree okay and all kiss brand okay girl got me a white one a baby pink this blue one here this coral pink and then this hot pink 
you guys, I just can't. Be on the lookout, okay? Oh, and then this one here. Sorry, little guy, I forgot you. Last beauty product that we found was this Pons. Um, just look at the packaging, you guys. Nicely sealed. And it says this is a perfect color complex anti-marks for natural color, okay? Um, this is for normal to dry skin. So I just thought that was just a really good find to find. Um, I'm gonna open it up and let's see if it has like a scent or anything like that. So here it is, how cute! I like the color. I like the packaging. Really cute. Oh. So doesn't really have a strong scent, but it says to use like a pea size on your face every morning. Is that what it says? Every morning. So yeah, you guys. I'm done. And that concludes my haul for today, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Be sure to give it a thumbs up. Um, let me know in the comment section what your favorite product was in this haul. And I will go ahead and see you guys next week. Bye.